2020 has been an extraordinarily difficult year for our country, our communities, and our churches. Hemos tenido que afrontar los desafíos de vivir con una pandemia global que a veces nos ha dejado sintiéndonos aislados y solos. We have confronted the racism that exists among us. And we sought to find a better way to be community together. Many of us are anxious and worried as we deal with the results of our presidential election, an election that has caused hostility and divisiveness in our country. En casa, en nuestras comunidades, incluso en nuestras iglesias y entre nuestros propios amigos. But at the same time, we are people who turn to our faith when times are difficult. We do not expect to find all the answers or strength we need from within ourselves. We look to one another and we look to our scripture. Jesus prays for our unity. Jesus models love. Through civil commitment with those who disagree and empathy for those who are hurting. Love is the most important gift, wrote St. Paul. Now is not the time to turn away from each other. Even if we have hurt one another. Now is the time to turn towards each other. Now is the time for us to remember that as the Book of Common Prayer reminds us. Que somos hechos en el bautismo, ciudadanos del reino de Dios a través de Cristo. We repent of the ways in which we have fallen short of God's high calling. Nos arrepentimos de las formas en que hemos negado la imagen de Dios en nuestro prójimo y pedimos perdón. Let us mend what is broken. Let us forgive and ask for forgiveness. Let us together pray for wisdom and discernment. For the ability to listen to one another and for the courage to meet the days ahead and to do so not with a message of hate or division, but one of hope. And an invitation to walk together, bound not in the clothing of our political parties, but in the baptismal garments of Christ. We don't all look alike. No todos pensamos igual. We did not all vote alike. But as Episcopalians in the Diocese of Texas, we have always chosen the higher, more costly road of Christ's cross. And the invitation by our Lord to walk together. Rather than to be torn apart. We acknowledge and proclaim that we are brothers and sisters, people of God, not by our mortal failings, but by Christ's sacrificial love upon the cross. Hoy, después de que se publiquen Los resultados de las elecciones mañana y pasado mañana. After every future election. Trabajamos la misión que tenemos por delante. We proclaim the gospel and we serve our neighbor. We believe that we are agents of reconciliation in a divided world. We are the repairers of the breach. El tiempo es ahora para que amemos a Dios y amemos a nuestro prójimo. To stand shoulder to shoulder as we step into the future. Let us accept God's given work and let us do so together. Trusting in God's grace and stepping forward in faith.